Good afternoon, classes of 2022 and 2023. This video is to provide you with an overview of graduation requirements, A through G college entrance requirements, career technical education pathways, advanced course options such as PLUS, honors, and AP courses, dual enrollment options, and this video is to help you guys prepare to fill out your pre-registration forms tomorrow to select your classes for the 2021-2022 school year. Graduation requirements. You will need to complete a total of 220 credits. You will complete the 220 credits by completing the following courses. Four years of English, three years of math, two years of science and PE, three years social studies, one year fine arts, two years of a foreign language, one year vocational education, one year health education, and three years of electives. You are expected to have at least a 2.0 GPA, 85% attendance for every academic year, and you will need to complete 60 community service hours. Hey Vikings, the counseling department would like to remind you of the subject requirements, also known as A through G requirements, which are needed to be eligible to apply to a four-year university directly after high school. Uh, we think this is really important information for you to keep in mind when you're making your course selections for next year. So let's go ahead and review. So for area A, um, which is history, students are required to complete two years. For area B or English, students are required to complete four years. And this may include one year of ELD for those students that were in the ELD program. For area C is math and students are required to complete three years and four years are recommended. And this, and at North Salinas High School, students take integrated math. Therefore, we will take math one, two, and three to meet this requirement. Next is area D or lab science and students are required to complete two years. And again, three years are recommended. The majority of our students at North High will meet this requirement by taking NGS1 and NGS2, while other students in the Ag Academy will meet this requirement by taking Ag Biology and Ag Chemistry. Next, we have Area E, or language other than English, and students are required to complete two years of that same language. And again, three years are recommended. Area F is Fine Art, and students are required to complete one year. And Area G, is the college prep elective and students are required to complete one year. It's also really important to remember that students must earn C's or better in every one of these A through G courses in grades nine through 12 to remain eligible. Hello friends, underclassmen. This is Dr. Pro from the Career Center. And if you are like me, you like to learn by doing and you like to get your hands dirty. You like to make things and create things. If that's the case, you might wanna take one of the following classes next year and complete an ROP CT pathway. We have art in the digital age, business technology, sports medicine, ag mechanics available for students that like to learn by doing. And those are single period classes. And the following year, you'll take the next class in the sequence to become a CT pathway completer. Double class wise or two period class wise, we have art history of floral design and agribusiness, and we have restaurant careers. Consider taking one of the following classes that are listed here on this screen. Develop your skills and your employability, earn industry certifications, and then also be recognized as a pathway completer at graduation. What are PLUS honors and advanced placement courses? When choosing your courses for next year, one important consideration is if you would like to challenge yourself by taking PLUS, Honors, or AP courses. You'll notice throughout your registration form that there are several opportunities for you to take any one of these advanced courses. All three advanced courses are great preparation for college or career. Whether you go on to Hartnell, a four-year university, enter the workforce or serve our country in the military, advanced courses will give you knowledge and preparation to help you reach your goals. All three advanced courses give your North Salinas High School GPA a boost. However, only honors and AP courses give you a GPA boost for college admissions. 
we encourage you to challenge yourself and where possible and it makes sense for you, consider taking an advanced course. Hi Vikings, next we'll be covering dual enrollment. Dual enrollment allows high school students to take college classes at the regular school during their regular school hours. All tuitions and fees are waived, books are covered in college, plus high school credits are earned. Next are the current dual enrollment classes being offered here at North Salinas High. Counseling 1, Student Success Seminar, course to assist first-time college students create greater success in college and in life. Counseling 27, Life Planning, Comprehensive Life and Career Planning course with a focus on key lifespan issues. English 1A, College Composition and Reading, fulfills the first year of college English and English 12 high school requirement. English 1B, College Literature and Composition, No, each class is worth three college units, 10 high school credits in one semester. In addition, each class transfers to the CSU and UC systems. Thank you, classes of 2022 and 2023, for tuning in. Reminder that you will be filling out your pre-registration forms tomorrow, and they will be due tomorrow as well. So your counselors will be available through office hours tomorrow if you have any questions. Thank you, and have a great day, Vikings.